Hello guys, KP Shamino here with the second guide for World of Fishing and I'm going to show you guys how you need to fish, uh, what are the things that you need to focus on and what are the things that I focus on and I think are very cool in the game. So first of all, so uh, be sure that you got enough bait, but that's not really necessary here because the good thing about this game is if you're on the water you can buy the bait on the water from the shop so that's not really a problem so what you need to do is be sure that you got your rod your reel that you got everything ready and then you go play freestyle i don't think there is a campaign and what i do always in this game is i just go to one area and i try to catch all the fish in that area you can check it on the wiki i will show you guys right away and at the moment my focus is on a certain area i'm not sure what the name was but i will know it right away this is my focus at the moment so it's mokpo and I want to get all the fish that are on this area. So most of the time I go to that area. I try to catch all the fish. And then I'm done for that area. And I move to the next area. Okay. So let's do a quick join. You just need to go to a quick join uh, match. If there is no uh, channel available. So here you see it's free mode. But sometimes it's private. You can just make your own room. How do you do that? Make a room. Uh, just put uh, your language in, how many people can fish there, is it an open, is it a private, you can name the room. Then you just create, and you will see I just created my own room, and now I can fish here. Okay, so let's get started. So you need to pay 2000 shells for it, and now we are getting on our way so what i do all the time is i already fished here a couple of times and i got like a lot of species i already got so here at the bottom right you got a wiki if you click on the wiki you you go to the name mokpo and you will see i still missing some fish and that are the specific fish that i want to catch so that's what i do the whole time uh, here you got like a map and there is a lot of fish in this game. So that's the fish that I'm going to focus on. And in this game it's not really complicated to find the fish. So at the top right you got for this area. But only for this area. So if I move the area is going to change. For this area I got all the fish that are sitting here. And you can just see which one that I already got. So you got a green marker on it. And that's the fish that I already got. So you just can scroll. So, and I think, yeah, I got every fish here in this area, so I need to move. What do you see too on this uh, screen here at the top? You see uh, a marker. So, it's not that the yellow one is common or, or uncommon. No, that means uh, the difficulty that he is. So, this one uh, is like a very rare one, but it's not that difficult for my level. Because his strength is 70 to 24. You got other fish. That are a little bit harder, but at this position I don't have a harder fish. Here is a green one. His strength is going to be less. So it's not that the color uh, says to you it's a common, uncommon. No, it's just how strong the fish is. So at the moment we got all the fish here. So what you need to do is you just need to move your boat. And I already got a very nice boat. And you will see at some point if you are going around map, you will see now check, check. This fishing spot has changed. So that means now I'm in another area with other fish species and most of the time this switch to. So what you need to do then is you just need to click it and I guess that I got all the fish here too. Yeah, everywhere I got the green marker. So we need to continue a little bit further. So and that's how you need to do it. So you just need it. It's not that complicated to be honest. Because uh, it's very easy to find the fish. But it's just to gathering the fish that uh, that makes it fun, I think. And uh, yeah, you got so many species in, uh, in this game. So it's always something else. And we need to go really far now. Because it's not changing. Still just the same. So we are just going and going and going. Until we got on another spot. And uh, I hope there is then a fish that uh, that I don't have already. That's uh, very important. Yeah, and it takes some time at the moment. I, I, it seems that this spot is totally the same the whole time. So let's keep going. I guess if you go... Oh, oh, check this, check this. Check. Now I got... 
two fish already. They are very uh, high compared to my level. So they got a very high strength. And what you need to do now is the next. So for example, I want to get the spotted sea bass. It's very common. It's very strong fish. And then you got preferred bait. So that's from the best bait to the worst bait. So now you see a spoon worm is the best bait that I can have for this fish. But the main problem is I cannot buy it. Because my level is not high enough. It's not in the shop for me. So the the first one that I got that I can use is the big uh, the big uh, anchovy. And so that's the one that I'm going to equip. So let's get a big anchovies on my hook. So uh, let's have a look where it is. Uh, I hope that I still got... Ah, I'm already fishing with it. So that's a good bait for the fish that I want because I don't have him to spot at sea bass. So what you need to do now is you can click here on cast at the bottom or you can just push C. If you push C you will see you get a marker and then you need to throw. So let's throw over there. So my bait is good. My equipment is good. I can uh, I can work with that fish. I'm not sure that the strength if it is 23 and 33 that you need to take an average and compare it with your strength. Because my strength is 150 already. So this fish is only, if I do the calculations quick, is like one fourth of my strength. I'm not sure that the game works like that. So here at the top left guys, here you got your stamina and check now. Now I got a bite, push left mouse button and the moment that you see a fish, you strike with right and do a sweep. Check. Perfect catch. Do you see it? And what you need to do now is, here you see the fish energy. And I, I'm now attacking the fish. Here you see how far he's away from you. And what you need to do is, you just need to reel with left mouse button. And you can swing. Swing, you do with swiping to the other direction checks. Like this. Check, swing. This was not successful. Check this. And what helps really well, check now the fish is coming to me. So you need to go away with your boat. Be sure that you're always alert. Because I already... Got a couple of times that he comes to me and that uh, that he breaks my line. So what you need to do is, so check, now I'm reeling but I don't have tension. I'm not damnish the, damnishing the fish. So what you can do is you can just move the boat. Check. Until you got more tension and then he's going to get fatigued a lot faster. Check, check how fast it goes now. So I'm just using my boat to pull myself on the fish. Let's do a stun. This was a stun. And now his fish energy is done. And we got a very nice fish. So I got a lot of experience for this one. It took me 1 minute and 5 seconds. Is a grade 5. I'm not sure. A grade 5 is uh, the highest is grade 1. So the, the, the most rare I think is 1. And then it goes down. This is the points that you are going to get. Uh, in your high score too, because you compete with other guys. So here you see now 491, that's the high score. Here this is a stamina, so if you do a swing, that's 3500 stamina that you use. So that's how you need to do it. So, uh, yeah, I don't remember what kind of fish it was, but I don't think it was a fish that I wanted, because I wanted the spotted sea bass. So let's do one more cast. So just cast. So if you see a bite, push left mouse button. The moment that you see the fish coming and your bobber goes under the surface, just do a right sweep to the other side and you most of the time you got a perfect strike. That's already 35% 35, 35 of the fish is uh, energy and that's really good. So you can use an underwater camera too, so you just use it with space. But I don't think that you can buy it. So you get it from quests and all that stuff. By the way, quests guys, be sure to pick up the quest. Okay, left mouse button. Right, check, bang. So 20% of the fish energy is already gone. And now I can just reel it in because the fish is swimming away. That was a swing. And we got the fish again. So 250 experience. I got a fortune card too. Put it in the life well. And that's how you need to do it guys. So just go around. Be sure that you got the right, uh, the right bait. You can see all the, the info here at the right top. You can get quests too. So be sure to pick up the quests because they give uh, nice stuff. So just go here to menu at the left. Just take quests. Click on those dudes. They give you a quest for a specific zone. Here you see your life fill. 
this blue one you can see i can uh, get 65 fish in my life well i got now two and it can go to 140 kilograms maximum here you see at your hot bars you see your hooks 26 uh, times i can use it my line i can only use uh, one time more uh, you can see how much bait that you got. Then there is one nice feature more that you can use here. That's uh, if you push on M, you're going to see a map. So if you discover a very rare spot on the map, I did it here with this one. So I just made uh, a position here. And I just put flathead mullet on it because I can catch them there. So how you need to do it, you just push here. Remember, you just type here. What kind of fish is sitting there? And the next time that you come back to the map, you can find really easy the position. I think for very, very rare fish, it's very good. Because if you come here and you compete against other, other guys and you know all the hot spots, you can just go over there, get the biggest fish, get the highest score, and you are going to win this. If you want to extend the free mode, because you want to fish a little bit longer, you can click here, extend. You just need to pay 2000 shells to uh, yeah, make it longer that you can fish here. So that was it a little bit for the, the fishing guy. So it's not that complicated. Uh, just uh, yeah, go a little bit around the map. Check at the top right your stuff. Uh, be sure that you got the bait. If you don't have the best bait, it can take some time. Uh, but that's it. You can gather a lot of fish. The leveling uh, is cool. You can get other gear. The, the fighting is a little bit strange. It's fighting with the fish. But if you like it, it's not... It's not a, how do you say it? You don't need to have like 7 degrees to find fish in this game. It looks really cool, I think. I like the Asian style a lot. It's like uh, they got detail. They got uh, costumes. They got everything. But it's a style. If you don't like it... Yeah, it's probably not game for you. But that was it for this guide, guys. I see you in the next guide. Thanks for watching. Thanks for the support. And see you guys later. Bye-bye.